Microsoft Azure Security Engineer Associate Professional Certificate. This is an interesting learning program that helps you prepare for a Microsoft exam. It really looks like a great opportunity to level up your skills and get job ready. But is it really worth it? My name is Daniel and today I have the Microsoft Azure Security Engineer Associate Professional Certificate review for you. So things I'm going to cover in this review are Course overview, structure and content, pricing and certification, career opportunities and I will let you know what I personally think about this course series. Also guys, make sure you check out all the useful links in the description after watching this video. There might be some nice discounts. Alright, let's start. Overview. So, this program is all about giving you the in-demand skills you need to get those Azure Security Engineer positions. To give you a better idea, here are some of the things you will learn here. Using Azure Active Directory to create and manage users, handle authentication and ensure identity protection and governance, setting up perimeter, network, host and container security, and using services like Azure Key Vault to secure your platform and applications keeping your data safe by implementing storage security, data sovereignty, database monitoring, encryption and data masking using tools like Defender for Cloud, managing security operations with Microsoft Defender and using monitoring tools like Azure Resource Monitor and Azure Monitor Application Insights. And on top of all that, it prepares you for the AZ500 Microsoft Azure Security Technology Certificate exam. This program covers everything you need to know, like managing identity and access, securing networks and handling security operations. All perfectly aligns with the exam requirements. Who is it for? Now, it's also worth noting that this certification program isn't for complete beginners. If you plan to enroll, it's a good idea to have some experience with Azure technologies under your belt. On top of that, having a solid grasp of computer networking and hybrid environments will be super helpful too. Structure and content. Guys, before we move on, I try to make my content fun instead of boring. And in return, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy the content I make. That's all. Alright, so there are 7 courses included in this professional certificate. Let's talk about them in a bit more detail. Security access with Azure Active Directory. In this course, you will explore Azure Active Directory roles, learn to create and manage users, groups, and administrative units. You will master tasks like adding, updating, deleting and restoring users and managing licenses. The course also includes Azure AD domain services. You will dive into authenticating and authorizing users and apps with Azure AD, covering password management, multi-factor and passwordless authentication. Additionally, you will implement pass-through authentication federation with Azure AD and configure Azure AD Connect for hybrid identity solutions in your organization. Identity protection and governance. In this course, folks, you will learn to protect identities in the Azure AD, understand enterprise governance basics and master Azure role-based access control. You will cover conditional access, multi-factor authentication and key features. You will explore planning and implementing privilege identity management, managing, assigning, activating and approving results for privileged access groups and investigating and resolving risks. The course will delve into the shared responsibility model, teaching you to create policies, configure access to services with RBAC and manage built-in roles for resource access, implement platform protection. In this course, you will secure your Azure environment comprehensively. You will cover perimeter security, network security and securing hosts and containers. Topics include network connectivity via peering, hub and spoke topology setup and defenses against DDoS attacks. Also, you will learn about VPNs for solution security, traffic management with network virtual appliances and Azure Web Application Firewall for attack prevention. Additionally, you will delve into defense in depth, endpoint and host security, network client server technologies, privileged access, serverless computing, and virtual machines. Secure your applications. In this course, you will master Azure Key Vault for safeguarding cryptographic keys and secrets used by cloud applications. Learn to create and manage access for secrets, certificates and keys. Explore the Microsoft Identity Platform to configure secure application access, covering user sign-ins, 
API calls and non-interactive apps, gain practical skills in app registration, setting up Azure Active Directory and registering applications. You will dive into Microsoft Graph services, configure permissions, understand managed identities and deploy web app certificates for a comprehensive learning experience. Secure your data at rest. In this course, guys, you will learn how to keep your data safe in Azure. You will cover storage security, data sovereignty, database monitoring, encryption, and data masking. Plus, you will get heads-on with Defender for Cloud for advanced threat protection. Manage security operations. This course is all about keeping your Azure resources and data safe and making sure you follow the rules and regulations. In this course, you will learn to use different tools to handle security operations. You will get hands-on experience with configuring and managing Azure Monitor. You will also learn how to enable and manage Microsoft Defender for Cloud. Plus, you will dive into setting up and monitoring Microsoft Sentinel, Capstone and Practice Exam AZ500. And in this final course, you will put all the skills you have learned from the previous six courses to test and get ready for the AZ500 exam. You will start with a quick recap of everything you have learned in course 1 to 6. Then you will dive into a real-world capstone project, where you will perform tasks just like an Azure security engineer. Lastly, you will take a practice exam to see how ready you are and get tips on how to enroll in the AZ500 Microsoft Azure Security Technologies exam. So, as you can see, guys, there is a lot of solid content here. Price and certification value. All right, let's answer the big question. How much does this course cost? Well, folks, it's not free. And honestly, offering it for free would be kind of strange. To sign up, you will need a Coursera subscription. The good news is that it's part of Coursera Plus. So, when you pay for this certification, you also get access to many other courses for free. And guys, I totally understand, months of subscription sounds like a lot. But based on some feedback, I have seen some people finish it much faster. Plus, it's definitely more affordable compared to the cost of a college degree. Now, let's talk about certification. When you successfully complete the entire certification program, you will also get a career certificate. And it can be a nice addition to your LinkedIn profile or your resume. But folks, let me be straight with you. In my opinion, the practical skills and knowledge you gain here are more valuable than the certificate itself. Based on my experience, employers are often more impressed by your professional knowledge and skills than the certificates you hold. Career opportunities You know, guys, my subscribers often ask me, Daniel, will this course help me land a job? Well, the short answer is yes, it can. Because this learning program is crafted to arm you with all the skills you need for an entry-level job. That's why it's rose in heads-on projects with real-world tasks. And it's all about preparing you for a job market. But, my friends, let's be real. Is it a golden ticket to a guaranteed career opportunity? No, I don't think so. Because you may want to keep improving those skills and actively preparing for interviews to get a job. Long story short, your success in job hunting is mostly about your own effort, with skills you have and not just online certification. Is the Microsoft Azure Security Engineer Associate Professional Certificate worth it? Alright, and finally, it's time for the most important question. Is this course serious worth investing into? And you know what, folks? I think it's definitely worth taking. If you are serious about security and Azure, you will get skills to protect Azure resources ensuring compliance with regulatory standards. Besides, it offers a great deal on heads-on experience that's highly valued in the industry. And you have to remember that the Capstone project and the practice exam prepare you comprehensively for the AZ500 exam. I think that makes this certificate a solid investment in advancing your career as a security professional in Azure. And it's all about my Microsoft Azure Security Engineer Associate Certificate review. Feel free to check out the course-related links in the description below, you might find some discounts there. As usual, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, until next time.